Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022 Gold Rush Football Autograph 16x20 Photos. That's a, it's a great size for framing, I think. Really, it'll really pop on your wall, at your office, living room, bedroom, man cave, woman cave, bar, if you work at a bar, whatever. Should be pretty cool. One spot gets you four random players. So there's 80 players on that list. Big thanks to these 20 right here. These 20 spots, let's multiply it by four. There's one already. There's two. There's three. And there's four. So you can see the last spot mojo star next to Steven's name. One, two, three, and four times right there. There's the list of players. And let's roll it and randomize it. Three and a two, five times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. Got Ryan down to Adam. Three and a two, five times for the players. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. After five, we've got Ron Jaworski. Ron Jaworski. Jaws. Down to Saquon Barkley. All right, so I'm going to show you the list as is, and then I'm going to... I'm going to then alphabetize by your first name so you can see all your all your uh, players collected together. So there's the first part of the list right here. There's all the way to 80 right there. So you can see Adam with uh, with Saquon Barkley right there. So let's sort by your first names by column A. So you can see Adam with Saquon again right here. So Adam, here's your block of players. Damian. Daniel. Joe P. Karen. Ryan H, the big block of team, uh, players right here. Rex, Stephen K, Stephen Flat, Tim, and last but not least, Zach with Gronk, Staubach, AB, and Calvin Ridley. All right, I'm going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades and players, and then we'll have the break. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back, everybody. There was a deal done. Two players for one. Stephen K is now out of the uh, Dawkins-Ray Lewis spot, and is going to get Doug Flutie. We'll put a T next to there for trade. And Joe P is out of the Doug Flutie spot, gets a couple players in return. Brian Dawkins and Ray Lewis. There you go, gang. Trade window is now closed. I'm also going to alphabetize by first name now, or by player name now. So it'll be easier for me to to dig up. So there's Joe P once again with Brian Dawkins. There's Stephen K with Doug Flutie. There's the trade. All right, let's flip back over here. Let's pop open this fresh case. All right, so if you can see on my uh, my face camera right here, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right? We'll go. We'll use the dice. So we'll go one, two, three for the boxes with the blue X's on them, and four, five, six for the boxes without the blue X on them. 
Three. One, two, three boxes with the blue X's. Stephen Punk, you think my Raiders are going to upset the Bengals this week? That'd be nice. But... Yeah, I think I think the the Bengals have a pretty good offense. That's going to be pretty hard to stop. The Raiders' secondary isn't that isn't that scary. They, Raiders can get a decent pass rush going. That might that might help. But we saw what Justin Herbert and Mike Williams did in the fourth quarter. In that last game, so all right. Now I'm gonna switch these back over here, and we'll play a little. Who am I? So put your thinking caps on. All right. So just to show you, here's here they all are. Any given Sunday for sure, but there they are. Good luck, everybody. This is a cool photo. Is he in the snow? I think he's in the snow. Oh, we're going to talk about that game a lot. Right? It's one of the one of the greatest Raiders Chargers games, one of the greatest wins ever. Oliver suggesting road dogs on wild card weekend. All right, I'm okay with that. All right, who am I? I'm a retired quarterback. Played for one, two, three, four teams my entire career. I was an NFL Comeback Player of the Year, a four-time Pro Bowler. I was a Big East Offensive Player of the Year and a Big East Rookie of the Year. Um, I have 22,464 22, passing yards, 133 touchdowns to 88 interceptions, 6,109 rushing yards for 36 rushing touchdowns. NFL record career yards per carry, 7.0. And career rushing yards, this should give it away, career rushing yards by a quarterback, 6,109. Who am I? Alex Smith and Doug Flutie combined may not have 6,000 uh, 6, career rushing yards. There you go. Kevin, Mark's got it. Darren's got it too. Michael, Vic. So that will go to that'll go to Joe P. There you go, Joe. This is a cool photo. Looks like he's in the snow, which is a which is a really cool shot. And then you got the uh, the authenticity sticker right there as well. And then there's the JSA card on the back. That's a cool picture, right? Yeah. All right, Joe P. Congrats. Two T's. One T, two L's. Two I's. All right, next one. This must be um
They don't put the player name on here, but I'm pretty sure it's this player right here. That's how he does his auto deck, right? Yeah. All right, who am I? Another quarterback. Uh, was a former second overall pick in the late 90s. Played for three teams my entire career. Six-time Pro Bowler. Part of this team's Hall of Fame. My number retired by this team, the team that drafted me. And part of this team's 75th anniversary team. A three-time Big East Offensive Player of the Year. Career 234 touchdowns. Career 37,276 passing yards. Um... And 3,459 rushing yards, 29 rushing touchdowns. And there is a case to be made that he should be in the... I mean, I think he's made a case for himself to be uh, in the Hall of Fame. I'm the fourth quarterback in NFL history to amass more than 30,000 passing yards, 200 touchdown passes... 3,000 rushing yards and 20 rushing yards, rushing touchdowns in my career. The first three quarterbacks to accomplish this were Fran Tarkenton, John Elway, and Steve Young. And I think they're all Hall of Famers, right? Yep, dear Darren Porter's got it. And Ryan, Donovan McNabb. And that's for you, Ryan Harold. There's his autograph right there. It's a good shot of Donovan McNabb. Nice one, Ryan. autographs I guess that's how he that's how he autographs it it doesn't really look like his name <laughs> All right, anyway, who am I? Another another retired player here, running back this time, born in San Diego, California, 6'2", 210. Went to Lincoln High School in San Diego, 10th overall pick in the early 80s, played for two teams in my entire career, a Super Bowl champion, a Super Bowl MVP, an NFL Most Valuable Player, NFL Offensive Player of the Year, NFL Offensive Rookie of the Year, NFL Comeback Player of the Year, um, 16 Pro Bowler, two-time NFL Rushing Touchdowns Leader, and NFL Rushing Yards Leader, and was a NFL Scoring Yards Leader, was a national champion, won the Heisman Trophy, Pro Football Hall of Famer, College Football Hall of Famer, and went to USC from 78 to 81. There you go. I think Mark's got it. And then Oliver, then Steven, then Kevin. Yeah, Marcus Allen. Nice little Super Bowl stamp right there. Yeah, I always forget that his, his autograph looks a little, doesn't look like it should be Marcus Allen, but there it is. 
Lots of hologram stickers there. The Beckett sticker in the back. It's pretty cool. Should have stayed a Raider the entire time. Um, Marcus Allen. Stephen Flat with Marcus Allen. Two more to go. All right, we got a active quarterback this time. Active quarterback, 33 years old, 5'11", 215 pounds, played for one team my entire career, a Super Bowl champ, a Walter Payton NFL Man of the Year, eight-time Pro Bowler. Uh, I've been a NFL passer rating leader, a passing touchdown leader, and a Bart Starr Award winner. I've got a career, um, 37,059 passing yards, 292 touchdowns to 87 interceptions, 4,689 rushing yards, and 23 rushing touchdowns. Third round pick. Went to NC State for a little bit. And then Wisconsin for the career. Yeah, I think everyone's got it. I think Stephen K got it first. Russell Wilson. And that is for Stephen K. Happier days for uh, in this picture here. There's the authenticity card here. Mill Creek Sports. Some corresponding stickers there for the photo. There's this familiar autograph right there in the middle, silver ink. And uh, happier times. The, did you realize that the confetti is the... Uh, the confetti is the trophy. I, I don't know when they started doing that, but. There you go. Very cool shot. Final one. The second half is in the store, ladies and gentlemen. Second half is in the store. If you want to run this back, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Another retired player here. Who I think is this this person? 
Yeah, it is. All right, who am I? Former uh, running back. My career between 1976, 1982 in the NFL. Late first round pick out of Ohio State. Um, did I win the Heisman Trophy twice? I think I did in 1974 to 1975. In the NFL, only ended up with 2,800 rushing yards. I don't know what happened in the NFL. It just didn't work out, I guess. Yeah, I guess guess he really didn't do much in the NFL, but he crushed it in, in college. Yeah, Archie Griffin went to the Bengals in 1976, but didn't really pan out. But, okay, considered one of the greatest college football players of all time. And this is how you want to remember Archie Griffin. Oliver got it, and then Ryan. That's what he does. Wins Heisman's. Nice gold ink autograph right there. Yeah, I know there's a lot of reflection on the big photograph top loader, but there's a good look at it. And there you go, gang. That's the break. Archie Griffin, that belongs to... That's going to go to Tim with Archie Griffin. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was a pretty fun break. We've got the second half in the store. I'm down to run it. So we'll see you next time for the next one. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.